Today, I'm in a build battle against my friends. But what they don't know is that I'm secretly cheating with slash slash scare, which will let me turn anything that I build scary so that I can terrify oh my, my friends. And the first round is... Wait, it says adventure map. Oh my God, adventure map? <laughs> Good luck, guys. You're gonna need it. Oh, they are going to need it all right because with what we are about to do today, guys, they are actually about to give their pants a, a, a pooping. If I type in slash slash scare, boom. Guys, we get not one, not two, but three Skidzy Industries boxes. And oh my goodness, they actually look insane. Guys, I'm so excited for this video. This might be the craziest build battle I have ever had. What do you have in mind? Tell me your idea. I was gonna do like, like a bank heist. Yo, I was gonna do a prison escape. Wait, a prison escape? What if we like do like a part one and part two? Like you build the beginning, we can make an ultimate adventure map together yeah yeah okay that sounds good all right bro good luck we've got the dark magic box the undead box and we also have the scary mirror box guys this is so scary what is that and the undead one okay that one looks pretty like virusy i'm guessing zombie apocalypse but then the dark magic one oh my gosh this looks insane so for an adventure map guys i can't lie this one is looking pretty juicy oh yeah oh yeah we're gonna start with the dark magic okay it looks like we got a wizard hat from skinzy industries and we have a book or wait is that a taco that kind of looks like a taco all right let's just pick up all of this and then this box and this box i'm just gonna leave in the back of my inventory for the next rounds but for now we need to figure out what this is book of dark magic with a mere flick of the page Ages, it can bestow the ordinary with a touch of the uncanny. Uh, okay, that was a lot of big words. So you know that this book means business. So we also have the Skidzy Industries wizard hat, a pointy cap specifically made for your big noggin. Hey, yo, big noggin? Guys, I, I don't I don't have a big head, do I? Wait, hold on. I'm, I'm trying to open it and there's like black particles. User not worthy? Oh, don't even tell me, guys. Does it want me to put the hat on? <laughs> no way! The hat has deemed you worthy? Yeah! <laughs> okay, I actually look pretty good. I can't lie. Check out the drip. Okay, so if I right-click it now... Oh my gosh, what the... Guys, I, I I actually became a wizard. You're a wizard, Skitsy. Okay, so now <laughs> I'm literally a wizard. I'm pretty sure if I just right-click... Oh, oh my gosh. I can turn anything scary. I turned the grass block scary and the... What is this, red concrete? I birthed you guys, but I, I need to kill you guys so no one sees you. Boom. Okay, there we go. I don't think anyone saw anything. Oh my gosh, get this giant hat off of me. <laughs> But wait, guys, that was insane. Using this book, I can literally turn anything scary. Okay, so we have to think, what exactly do we want to make? Let's just fix this giant hole in the ground. Okay, there we go. So since we can turn like literally anything scary, the first thing that comes to mind is Scary Alex. And if you guys don't know who Scary Alex is, <laughs> trust me, you will soon find out. <laughs> <coughs> Okay, I think that's pretty good for the body. And honestly, I don't even know if I need to like make the build scary itself. I'm pretty sure the book will like do it for me. So I'm just gonna make like regular Alex and then we're gonna find out if it like makes her spooky or not. I, I have no idea what to expect. I'm sorry guys, I'm new to being a wizard. This is my first day on the job. But what I will say is that my plan is to- Oh my gosh, guys, we made bald Alex. It's bald, my eyes. Oh, okay, there we go. Much better. So like I was saying before I was distracted by scary Alex's bald head, is that my goal for the video is to try to scare... Okay, that is not right. It's to try to scare Izzy or Biotic so badly that they leave the server. Guys, if I could make one of them leave from getting scared, oh my gosh, that would be so funny. But wait, they actually have crazy looking builds. What am I looking at? Is this supposed to be like a prison escape? Oh my gosh okay they actually have pretty good builds all i have is one little tiny alex okay so we need to put the hat on and we need to open the book and now is the time to create scary alex holy cow oh Oh my gosh, yo, 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 what the? Oh no, I don't even want to get near this. Excuse me, are, are you okay? Oh, yo, there's, we got some, we got some ketchup on the hands. Oh, this is not good. Guys, what have I created? Okay, so it doesn't seem like she's doing anything. What if I go into like survival mode? Oh, 
Oh my. Oh, she's coming towards me, guys. She's coming. Ah! Yo, 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 yo. Okay. No. Okay. Okay. We're back in creative mode. I don't know what she does when she catches you, but I don't want to find out until I put Izzy and Bionic into this adventure map. So now that we have our super scary monster for the build, yo, why is she shaking? We need to build her a humble abode. Boom. Okay. I think that's a pretty good start for like a creepy log cabin. And we could just give it like some framing like that. Ooh, okay, that doesn't look bad, but yeah, we definitely need to add some, like, windows. And then let's go ahead and put a roof on this bad boy. And boom, you now have a very lovely house. You're welcome. So I think the next step, guys, is we need to put Scary Alex into the spooky cabin. And the only way that I know how to move her is to go into survival. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay, don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me. Run, 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 run. Okay, just follow me. Whoa! Yo, she made some sort of noise. She does not want to come in here, guys. Okay, let me just board up these windows so she can't escape. She literally just hissed at me like a cat giving birth. Okay, okay, okay. Come here. Come here, Alex. Just enter, please. Just come on in. Oh my gosh, she's in. She's in. What did... Okay, all right. She was not happy about that, but we got her into the house. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Hopefully Izzy or Bionic didn't hear any of that like screeching. Okay, so the next thing that I'm thinking of adding is guys, we got to give this map some lore. So what I'm thinking is we make like a police van. Okay, something kind of like this. And I'm thinking that Izzy and Bionic are going to spawn in this van and they are police detectives. And they have to go into like a spooky forest with a cabin because they got to report that something is wrong. And so for my adventure map, I'm thinking they'll start here and then they'll have to like collect some like evidence or something. I don't know. I'll have to figure that out. But for now, I think we could add a little bit more detail to this. Yeah, we could put some like furnaces like that. That kind of looks like the engine. And then we could put like a guard gate on it. And then wait, hold on. We could use visible item frames and now we got headlights baby oh wait all right there we go now we have headlights and we could even put like the reflectors on the side kind of like this and then we need tail lights so let's just do that yo that looks so good and oh my gosh wait yes this will be like the doors in the back and then because this is like a police van we could put like a, an antenna thing on top and oh my gosh wait how could i forget yes we need the lights there we go and then let's put some lore detective izzy collected evidence and then detective bunk collected evidence all right boys so now we just need to fill up the map so i'm thinking over here we could definitely put like a mountain and then like inside of the mountain maybe we could have some like caves so let's go ahead and just smooth all this out using some world edit and oh my gosh wait guys what if inside of the cave is where scary alex she keeps her victims and i think we could go ahead and just make the inside of the cave just a lot more creepy oh my gosh guys wait this cave is already so creepy and it goes like so deep so back here this is where we could put like the first clue so we could put some like skulls and stuff and then using the invisible item frame, we could put a book and quill down. Yes, but we should probably write something in it. Day nine. I was on a camping trip until something eerie took me and my friends into this cave. I don't know if I'll survive. So we can name this evidence one and we'll just put it right there. And so it's up to Izzy and Biotic to find that and bring it back to the, the police mobile without dying to scary Alex. Hey guys, I think we could actually make this even spookier. We could put some like, iron bars like she trapped these people back here oh my gosh okay that's perfect let's put a doorway and since they were on a camping trip let's just add some more lore like over here we can make like a tent thing yo okay that looks pretty good but then on the inside we could add some like sleeping bags and then on the outside yo you guys already know i feel like this is how every scary movie goes it's always like all the friends and they're having a great time and they're always sitting around the fire you know laughing and then boom something drags them like into the woods and so wait we we could actually like leave a trail if they're good enough detectives they'll notice this like blood trail going into the cave and wait guys i'm actually thinking why only stop with scary alex wait is she even in there is she oh okay good she's still there what if she escaped that'd be so scary but guys what if we try like a jukebox because ideally we could get scary music oh my holy cow guys wait what what is this okay i'm right clicking it nothing's happening maybe i could try a lever yo yo what is this music what is this music? 
Oh, no. Nah. Oh, no. Guys, this is actually so cool. We have to play this, like, while they're on my adventure map. Yo, they are actually going to poop themselves. I'm just gonna put it right there. And I'm thinking, like, what if we try making something else kind of scary? Like, maybe something over here before they see Scary Alex. Guys, we could put some, like, jack-o'-lanterns kind of like this. But then what happens if we... Oh, my gosh. Wait. Okay, it still kind of looks like a jack-o'-lantern, but wait, is it following me? Are, are you gonna... What? What is... What are you doing? Wait, it just follows you wherever you go. Oh! <gasps> Okay, guys, that is so creepy. So they're gonna think that this is like the big scary thing. They don't even know what's about to come. Okay, let's make the rest of these into scary jack-o'-lanterns. There we go. Oh my gosh. And okay, so I'm thinking we gotta fill up this area. So let's just put like a ton of spruce trees. Oh my gosh. Okay, that is so much better. So let's go ahead and make like a road right here for the car. All right, there we go. And I'm thinking, what if we added like a giant ravine in the ground? Okay, yes, just like that. That is perfect. And then I'm thinking we could put like a spooky bridge. And I feel like this is definitely like another scary movie, just like cliche, where there's just a super old rickety bridge that they have to cross. And there we go. Okay, that looks pretty good. But now we need to make it like super dangerous. Boom. Okay, there we go. So then I'm thinking, yeah, we definitely need to put the pumpkins like on the bridge just to creep them out. So I'm so sorry. I have to get rid of you guys. I I'm sorry. <laughs> so let's go ahead and get some new ones. We'll put one there. And then we already have one there. So let's put another one like right here. And then one there. And then let's go ahead and give them life. And oh my gosh, guys, this is so creepy. They literally just follow you everywhere you go. Okay, so now I think we just need to add a little bit more detail to the inside of Scary Alex's humble abode. And we can definitely just add some like cobwebs and stuff. And you guys already know, this is definitely where the second piece of evidence needs to be. So let's go ahead and just put like a ton of skulls up here. And we can't forget the redstone, the blood. Oh, we could even have like a trail near the front. Oh my gosh, yo, this is so creepy. So let's put the item frame like right here. And then we'll put but help a scary monster got me and my friends help <laughs> <laughs> and now we just name it evidence. There we go. Yes. Okay. That is perfect. Oh my goodness. Okay. There's only 10 minutes left. So we need to think what else could we add? Oh my gosh, guys. I got it. Okay. So they're going to cross the bridge right here. So I'm going to throw them off again and I'm going to make like a giant graveyard using some coarse dirt. Yeah. Just like that. And so they're definitely going to check the graveyard first and they're definitely going to think this is where the evidence is going to be. So we could use andesite for the pillars. Okay. Yes. Just like that. And then using some world edit, we should be able to just fill in the gaps and then this will be like the grand entrance right here and wait guys we can make this like really spooky with some like spiky walls yes oh my gosh yo that looks so good so now we just need to make all of the graves and then at the end here we can just put like one of those little like house thingies i don't really know what they are but i feel like graveyards always have like a house at the end and we could add some like little windows maybe something like this guys they are for sure gonna think that this is where the first piece of evidence is but no guys i'm actually such a troll we're literally just gonna have cobwebs and skulls and that's it and then i think one of the last things that we need to do is we just need to make like a giant path kind of going around the map like we'll have it lead to the tent kind of like that but the last detail that we can add is like a little starter kit so let's go ahead and grab a stick and we're just gonna name it officer bunk baton and officer izzy baton and there we go that's what they get <laughs> <laughs> so real quick, I know the timer is definitely about to be up, but we could add some chests like in the graves. And guys, I can't lie. I think the cave, we need like just a ton of dripstone everywhere. Yo, that actually looks so spooky. And then this is where the evidence is, but just to make it even more low key, I'm just gonna kind of block it up like that just to make it a little hard for them. And oh my gosh, wait guys, that is time. Let's do this. All right, follow me guys for the best adventure map, and maybe you'll make it out. Come on, guys. Mr. Izzy, what did you make? This is the pillager bank outpost maze thingy. It's a bank heist. Yo, Bionic, we gotta rob the bank. It's just you and me? Izzy, what are you doing? No, don't worry. I'll, I'll be watching you guys. Okay, so the red chest is mine. You get the blue one. Izzy, what's inside? Just just some items you'll need. I got four poopoos. There's only one rule, guys. You're going survival? Yeah, you guys need to go in survival. And you cannot use your pickaxe inside. Okay, so I think, should we go through the All front? Right, or good luck, guys. Oh my, he just disappeared. Okay, dude, should we go through the front or should we scout out like a side? 
side like back entrance. No, we gotta go through the front forehead mode. Yo, I don't think I don't think Izzy was smart enough to make like a back. Yeah, there's literally nothing there. <laughs> With these adventure maps, I feel like you actually have to do it legit. Okay, okay. So we definitely need to use the four blocks to get across. Here, I got, I got you, I got you. There you go. I place, I place the next block. Yo, what kind of bank is this? This way, guys. <laughs> Why do I feel like that's a lie? Why do I feel like that's a lie? I, that's definitely a lie. There's a winky fit. No, I'm going this way, bro. I'm going this way. Do we split up? Yo, this is not Scooby Doo. We don't need to split up and search for clues. Well, the look, there's two ways. It's a regular chest, I think. It's not gonna like blow up, right? Okay, I'm checking it. Hint. Wait, we didn't. Eat this is our first room. Wrong way, poopy butt. <laughs> Oh my god, he's so annoying. That's the hit? Nah, dude. Okay, what's over here? I don't see anything. Dude, what kind of bank is this? There's another... It's literally empty. Dude, you checked that way too fast, kids. You gotta watch out, bro. It could have been a trap. Yo, dude, dude. There is no traps here, bro. I don't know what kind of bank this is. Yeah, for real. Wait, what? It's a bank with a maze? Yo, 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 yo. Green flags. Green flags. Okay, okay. We must be going the right way, right? Almost there. Go left. Yo, why do I feel like he just put that sign here? <laughs> oh my gosh. Wait, I found iron blocks. Oh! <gasps> Bro, it's the vault. Yeah, yoink. Free loot, baby. Yo, why do I hear pillagers? Yeah, wait, I hear pillagers too, but I haven't seen any. Grab it all, Skitty. We're rich. We're rich forever. We'll never have to pay for cheeseburgers again. Yo, we got the loot, bro. We gotta go. We gotta go. Yo, how do we get out? How do we get out? Yeah, it was this way. It was this way to the left. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go, 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 go. Watch out. Yo, I do hear a lot of pillagers. Nah, dude, I'm turning on the jets. Watch out. Yo, biotic. I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh. Oh, yo, what just happened? We just got arrested. You you guys got caught, bro. You couldn't make it out. Caught? What do you mean we... Oh, my. You my. guys got arrested. You couldn't do the bank heist. Dude, I don't know. What kind of bank is this? And wait, is there more stuff up here? You here? guys missed the warden's office up top. Yo, there's tons of loot, bro. Oh, my God. There's more diamonds in here. Yo, Mr. Izzy, I can't lie. This is a pretty hard bank heist. I don't even know how we were supposed to get up to the upstairs. There was a ladder on the side, dude. Look, you guys missed it. You didn't even look on this side. I don't know. I don't know about this. I think this is a pretty good adventure map. A little a little too hard. I'm going to give it a, a 7 out of 10. Bro. It definitely deserves more than that. But you know what? I'll take it. Uh, that's, I'm going to weigh your bill, bro. I'm going to give it 6 out of 10. <laughs> Gaga. I can't, bro. Can we just move on, man? Who's next? Yeah, we can move on. Now that we're arrested, come over here, gentlemen. Come over here. Why are you emphasizing arrested? What 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 is what is about to happen, Izzy? This is part two. <laughs> Yo, what? How did you know we were gonna get arrested? Yo, was I working with an inside agent this entire time? He betrayed you, Skizzy. Right no, why would I betray him when? Hold up. Uh, guys, what? Where am I? Skitty, I'm in the other cell. I'm in the other cell. We got arrested. Dude, we can't break anything. Wait, are we in adventure mode? I'm about to fall into a pit of lava. <laughs> Yo, what? Yes, yeah, Skitty, we got to save Izzy. Dude, I got to save myself. Wait, what? I got a fishing rod? Yeah, look for some items. Look for some items. All right, Skitty, use your big brain. What do I see? Oh, I see a sapling. No, not a sapling, bro. Dude, there's a key. There's a key? Get it. You should probably get it. I'm going to fishing rod the key. Dude, oh. hurry up. I'm going to oh fall, oh man. There's guards all over the place. <laughs> Peace. My fat fingers don't fit through the window. Oh, 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 I got it. Oh my gosh. Wait, I can just put the lever here in. Uh, dude, I'm out. Biotic. Save me, bro. Save me. Come out, bro. Come out. Let's go, dude. Oh my gosh, bro. Where do we go from here, dude? Wait, you're not allowed to tell me. I got to figure this out. Okay, wait, we got it. We got to get in here. We need another lever. Skinty. Yo, what? You found another key? Yo, so we got to go through here? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, watch out. I think there's a guard there. Oh my God. Beat him up. Beat him up. Beat him up. Wait, Skinty inside. There's an iron sword. Oh, never mind. We didn't need it. <laughs> Yo, we actually just punched him to death. Wait, cookie. There's a cookie. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, we could go back in our cells now. We got a cookie. No, we got to focus, Skinty. Bro, come save me, man. Oh, yeah, we forgot about Izzy. Okay, we have an ender pearl. One out of two. Yo, hold on. I'll grab these arrows. You can grab the sword. Okay, I got the sword. And wait, I got a button too. No, that's useless. That's for a mouse. That's for a computer, idiot. Focus. We got to find the second pearl, Skinty. It said one out of two. Dude, I'm using all of my brain cells right now, dude. I don't know where to find the second pearl we gotta think where could it hide uh, um. yo i found it dude i found it yo you found it that was all me bro let's go get it out get it out yo i wait i just hit it i got it i got it i got it let's go okay where do we go next all of these iron bars are like locked up e these are even shut in skitty dude I, yeah there's no windows to pearl out of bro where do we go wait yo what is this? It looks like this one broke. Oh my gosh, dude. No way. From this angle, we can make it to outside the prison. Dude, this is actually the perfect angle. Okay, so we have to get it. Oh, nice, nice, nice. Watch out. Skinzy, no. Skinzy. 
<laughs> oh, hey, I'm back. Oh, he's back. Run. I'm back and I'm being attacked. I'm coming. I'm coming. Oh my gosh, I'm here. Yo, shoot him up. Shoot him up. I'm one hit, bro. I'm one hit. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Hey, I, I totally didn't die. Yo, I killed a few though. <laughs> Yo, dude, let's go. Oh my gosh. Wait, the roses. Who cares about the roses? Is he? Is he? Why did you spawn up there, bro? bro? I can't even get out. You're actually going to fall in the lava. Yo, that's your punishment for making a horrible adventure map. <laughs> we got to save him. He doesn't deserve it. I guarantee you there's something sus about all these little like dirt mounds. No, this, this is actually all the poop. This is where they keep all the poop. Yeah, right. Because I knew it. There's a trap. What the? There's a hiding Pete. Who are you? Yo, Pete, bro. You miss me? W from church? Yo, you guys are homies? Yeah, but he's crazy now. Yo, what are you doing? I don't even want to know who Hidden Pete is, but wait. TNT can be used to break an entrance. I mean, ew. I don't want that. Don't put it back. Ew, I don't want to touch it. Okay, so I don't, I don't want to carry it. We have flint and steel and TNT now. Forget the poop. Yo, we got it blast in from the front entrance. Okay, yo, so should I just... I just put it right here. All right, bro. Blow it up. Blow it up. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, my gosh. And yo, we're in. Go, 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 go. FBI, open up. Oh, no. Wait, Skidzy, I'm actually dead. I'm actually dead. There's way too many. Back up. Back up. Run this way. Run this way. Kill them. We're coming, Izzy. We're coming. Inside the armory. Inside the armory. Quick. Oh, my gosh. Let me in. Let me in. Let me in. Oh, my God. I have one heart left, dude. Okay. Dude, I have one heart left as well. Yo, take the armor. Take the armor. Gear. We're, we're stacked. We're stacked. We're stacked. We're stacked. Yo, this is actually sick, dude. This is so cool. All right, bro. Now we got to save Izzy. So wait, if I go up the stairs... I feel like we're missing something, Skizzy. Yo, Izzy. Izzy. Skizzy. Yo, Izzy. Get me Izzy. out, bro. Bro, how do I get him out? Oh, my gosh. Wait. Okay, we need to find one more item to get you out, buddy. We can't break you out, bro. It doesn't let me. Maybe something in the kitchen? Yeah, I heard the kitchen has a secret. Oh, my. It's the water bucket, bro. I knew it. Can be used to escape. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Izzy, we're coming. We raided the kitchen, Izzy. Izzy. I can smell escape. If I just put the water there, there we go. Izzy, we got you pork chop. We got you emerald. Take chicken. Okay. Oh, Thank you, guys. All right. There you go, buddy. Let's buddy. go. We saved and we did it. Let's go. We did it, bro. Ah! Ah! Oh my God. Ah! Uh, um, the end of the adventure map. <laughs> Woo! Dude, I can't lie. I actually felt like I was in a movie, dude. That was so sick. Thank you. I was like your your hint, your hint man. I was like, yo, there's something fishy around here. Yeah, my brain was not big enough to figure it out on my own, dude. But I give this a 9 out of 10, dude. This is so good. Let's go. I love how you use me as the guinea pig, dude. I'm gonna rate this a okay. 7. Okay, that's, I'll take that. Okay, listen up, gentlemen. We had action. We had suspense. But now, gentlemen, let me introduce horror. What? Where are we? Welcome, gentlemen. You guys are now a part of the academy. I don't know how you guys got in, but yeah, you guys are cops now, all right? Oh, and your you mission- sign up for this? Uh, you never you really have a choice, but your mission is to collect evidence, okay? You guys just need one piece of evidence each. There's two out there. And then what? We have to put it- Okay, he literally just appeared. I think we have to put- Yo, yo, yeah. I think we have to put the evidence inside of the chest. We have batons here. Bonk baton, bonk baton. All right. Oh my gosh, guys. I literally didn't tell them anything, but I'm going to activate the jukebox. They are actually- about to poop their pants. Yo, is that... You hear something? Yo! That sounds so creepy! What are these pumpkin heads, man? I don't know. They're staring at us, though. Every move we make... Oh, my God! Oh, my oh God. wait, it's a mob! Yo, beat it up! Wait, are we supposed to be in survival? Yeah, they don't do any damage. Okay, I beat him up. It dropped a jack-o'-lantern. Okay, guys, let's see. Will they make the parkour? All right, watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out. Oh, my God! Yo, I actually almost fell. Yeah, yeah, don't, don't, don't. Watch out, watch out. <laughs> watch Yo! Out. <laughs> yo, yo, chill, chill. Okay, so it looks like they made the parkour, but now they're gonna go into the graveyard. Is this a cemetery? Yeah, wait, I think so. Wait, there's skeleton heads. There's a wither skull. No. All right, I took him. I took. I took him. I took him. Okay, while they're distracted with the graveyard, you guys already know I'm gonna open the door. I just opened the door. Oh my gosh, there she is. The door is open. Wait, what is that inside? Wait, what? What did he say? Dude, there's something inside of that house, bro. What are you talking about? What are you talking about? No, no, no. Wait, wait, wait. You go first. You go first. What do I have to go first? What is this? Oh, it's it's a record player. Um, <clears throat> that's uh that that's for uh staff only. <clears throat> We're just gonna staff only. That little rat. All right, just go inside, dude. Come on, we don't have time for this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch out. There's blood. There's blood. There's blood. <gasps> oh my god. Oh, oh my, my god. god. What oh is that, god. dude? Oh I told oh you. God. It's not attacking. Give it a hug, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Yo, yo. Do not push me, bro. Oh my gosh, bro. 
She's actually guarding the cabin. Yo. Oh. Oh my god. Yo, it moved. It moved. It moved. It moved. It moved. It's when you stop looking at it. It's, Wait, it's, it doesn't I work look, if I look, look at it. Oh my god, she's literally chasing him. Oh my god, it's faster than me. Okay, bro, I'm gonna go check the house. Yes, go check the house. That's what I've been trying to tell you. <laughs> Yo, this is so scary. I'm gonna search the house. There's blood everywhere. Oh my god, there's evidence. Okay, wait. Evidence. Oh, a scary monster got me and my friends. Help. <laughs> it said a scary monster got them and their friends what do we do man is he got the first piece of evidence i don't care about the friends anymore bro i didn't sign up for this well, all right I, i'm gonna go look in this cave bro Th there's a cave as well okay okay i'll run over here with you okay wait it stopped oh chasing God. us oh my she's coming into the cave it's coming no 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 it's coming bro stare at it stare at it it doesn't work if i look at it man what are you talking about it still walks yo they found the secret room they found the secret room no don't don't lead it over here don't lead it over just go inside bro just go inside wait. go inside go 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 oh my god oh my god the other oh piece of evidence in Yo, I got I got another piece. I got another piece. Come on, read it. Hurry up. Day nine. I was on a camping trip until something eerie took me and my friends into this cave. I don't know if I'll survive. Wait, we got the both piece of evidence. We just gotta make it back to the van. No, I'm gone. I'm gone too. I'm gone too. I'm following you. Jump over the bridge. Jump over the bridge. Oh my god, it's chasing me. Oh my gosh. Yo, they're actually gonna make it back. Danny, hurry! Help! It's behind Help! you, hurry! Oh my god. Yes, I made it past the bridge. We're safe. We're safe. Wait, why is it freaking out? Why is it? Yo, it's going around. Run inside, run inside. Oh my god, open the door. Open the door. Open the door. I'm putting my evidence in there, bro. We did. We did it. All right. We, we got it. We got it. it. We got it. Oh, my gosh. Gentlemen, welcome to the academy. I quit. I quit. What do you mean you quit, bro? Why? I quit the academy. Oh, it's right there. Beat it up. Just beat it up, bro. Beat it up. Not so tough now, are you, huh? Stop beating her up. Yeah. Two. We solved this case. Yo, I can't even lie. You guys actually figured it out. I didn't think you'd be that smart. Wow, dude. Come on, man. We're Minecraft gods. We're genius cousins, man. Our IQ combined is like... 8 trillion. Oh, yeah. 8 trillion. All right. Is that the score that you give me then? No, 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 no. That's not your score. I'm not going to lie. I think the attention to detail was so fire. Dude, this is probably one of your best builds ever. Dude, I got to rate this a 10 out of 10. This was so fun. Let's go. Yeah, I'm going to give you a 9.5 out of 10. I'm going to have to agree with Danny. This, this was really, really good, bro. Woo! All right, the next one is civilization. You're going down, idiot. Yo, what? Okay, yeah, you guys are going down. See you later, nerds. Okay, so the next round is civilization. So I'm thinking that why is there an arrow in my butt? Okay, anyways, we can't get distracted. If we do slash slash scare, we have our three boxes. So we've already used the dark magic one, which was epic. But now we need to pick between the undead box or the scary mirror box. And I can't lie, guys. I think the scary mirror box is probably the scariest one that we have so i want to save best for last so i'm thinking that we do the undead box boom hey yo what what do we what is this huh okay it's like moving patient zero injection the entire apocalypse within a needle guys i think we have the zombie apocalypse needle right here and wait this is perfect it's civilization okay yeah we have to build a city and honestly a city is not going to be hard to make with world edit we could make one pretty quick so let's go ahead and just add some details and then we could copy this and just paste it with world edit and wait oh my gosh guys what if we make this like an adventure map kind of like the last one where they have to survive the zombie apocalypse we could literally start one in the city and maybe we could put like a getaway helicopter at the top oh my goodness my creative juices are flowing all right so let's just go ahead and spam this and then we could just paste the other side oh my gosh yeah in like five seconds guys we already have a building just like that there we go yep we have an entire building now and then i think a a cool little build hack is we can make these like little ac vents yes like those are the fans and then let's go ahead and add like the big antenna thingy that buildings have like that and then i think just around the corners we should add like a border and we can even put like iron bars just as like a little safety gate because i mean these guys are going to be going to the rooftops to try to escape the zombie apocalypse so we don't want them falling off okay audience and then next thing that we could do is we could just add some like shrubbery sometimes nature could just take the edge off a little bit all right so now we could just go ahead and paste in yep the same thing there we go bro he has no idea i'm on his side i'm literally not even vanished okay yo yo
Yo, yo, he's snooping on me. He's snooping on me. Oh my gosh, I think I might copy him. Oh, okay, I'm gonna act like I don't see him, guys. Slash, slash, copy. And if I do like maybe slash, slash, paste. Oh my gosh, it worked. But you know what? If he wants to watch me, that's fine. I'm just gonna go, I'm just gonna keep working on the city. He's gonna see this and literally just be like, what? When, how? So I'm thinking we could actually change up the colors of these buildings. Like this one could be kind of like dark gray. Oh, that looks nice. We can make this one like a bluish. Yes, let's go. Okay, and then this one, we could do like a yellow. Oh, that looks pretty good. And then I think, wait, if I just paste another one. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I can make it even taller. So let's go ahead and get rid of the doors and we got to get rid of these plants. So now we have like a building that just looks a little different from the other one. So it doesn't look like I just copied all these. And boom, there we go. We have some more buildings. And let's just go ahead and change the color of this one. Oh, and then we can make this one brick. Yeah, okay, that looks really good. And then listen, guys, you already know we need some roads in this city. Okay, so this is gonna be the main road. And then we'll have this one cross right there. And then we just need like one more little one over here. And yo, who's putting doo-doo all over my wall? What the heck is going on? No, he took my building and wait, he didn't just take it. He made it like ugly. Like what is that block? Okay. You know what guys? I don't have time for this, but we are definitely going to have to check in on this little rat. Oh, he knows he, I don't, I don't even have anything to say to him. I'm just going to block it off. Dude. Oh no. He's going to get so mad. I didn't think he was going to see before the round is over. Okay. So let's go ahead and add this road and then let's go ahead and add all the sidewalks. Boom. Okay. Wow. This is actually really looking like a city. And listen guys, I don't want to get too caught up on the details, but you're you know we gotta add just some trees here and there okay so now we need to figure out which building we want to put a helicopter on and i'm thinking this one like just smack dab in the middle but wait oh <gasps> Guys, what if we made this like a hospital? Like this is where the infection started. Okay, I could definitely just like rebrand this building as a hospital. Okay, boom, now it's white. Okay, we're definitely gonna need like a giant red cross on the corner. And then we can make the side of the building just kind of come out like this. And then I'm thinking, yeah, we could definitely just put a ton more windows. And then let's just add a little bit of detail to these windows. And boom, okay, all the windows are now blue tinted glass. I don't know why I feel like that looks so much more like hospital vibes now. Okay, so I'm thinking they'll probably need to to take like the elevator shaft to get to the roof and now thinking let's just make the roof glowstone and then we'll make the floor wool and then we'll put the sign right here elevator out of order okay that is actually perfect because now they need to take the ladder through the trap door thingy so now we just need to make the tunnel leading up to the roof okay perfect definitely like this and we'll definitely hide some zombies up in here too and then maybe we could do some like parkour kind of like this okay wait and then maybe we could put some like trap doors like that and then they'll have to jump here and then we could just make this look like the next floor so they'll have to go like onto the edge here oh that is perfect okay so we can have the ladder lead to like this edge and you guys already know we're gonna put a ton of zombies like on the edge here and since the zombie outbreak literally just happened we could just add like fire just make it look like pandemonium all right so then this could look like the next floor and honestly guys that would be so sick if this is where everything started so we can make like a little wall like right here and then the sign saying patient number zero so this would be like the hospital bed and then we could put like a painting yes just like that but then we need to make it look like it all went wrong we definitely just need to put blood everywhere and then this could just be like the zombie juices just like everywhere and then over here we have to put a sign saying emergency roof access yes okay it's perfect because then this is gonna lead to the helicopter oh my gosh wait five minutes okay guys wait whoa 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 we have five minutes to make a helicopter okay so this will be the helipad and then let's put barrier blocks like this that way they have to like climb up to the heli who's like driving by to pick them up okay i literally just spit everywhere i'm getting too excited about this all right we should definitely make it like a red and white heli to make it look like it just came from the hospital and then let's go ahead and put the windows in okay that actually doesn't look half bad but then up top let's go ahead and just add a ton more barrier blocks and then we could just go ahead and put trap doors like on top and then these will be the rotors and then for the tail rotor we definitely just need to use levers like this and now the last detail the getaway pilot his name's philarp Flarp. F f fil Flarp. Phil, just call him Phil. Okay, so now if we're gonna make a zombie apocalypse, we're gonna need a ton of villagers in here. That's right, guys. We're gonna need a population because I think if I just like right click, oh, oh my gosh, no. no, 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 I didn't mean to do that. Okay, wait, hold on. I think I can fix this. Oh my gosh. Okay, I just killed every single mob. Okay, so now we know what we're dealing with. So let's just get like a new needle. Okay, there we go. And let's make our population once again. And oh my gosh. Okay, that's perfect timing. All right, guys, I wanna welcome you to Moosh 
City. Moose City? Yeah, welcome. These buildings look a little familiar, don't you think? Well, they're buildings, you know. I think uh, a lot of places use similar architecture. texture. I will say, Mr. Bonk, Moose City is actually pretty sick. There's Moose citizens they're everywhere gamers how do they live in these buildings man yeah hey there's nothing in here bro we can play that game we can play that game but this right now is the city district and if you guys follow me this way over here oh my gosh wait i love how they're like wearing red because they're moose citizens and they have their own houses this is the residential area the moose residential wait what's going on over here watch out watch out don't skip don't skip don't skip you gotta get in line yo take the soup take the soup that's why they're such a big line because everybody's like, yo, I need that world famous stew. Mm -hmm. Oh, yo, did you make this? Ew. Wait, let me try it. Yo, Izzy, don't try it, bro. Bro. <laughs> <laughs> you killed Izzy. No, I didn't, bro. It's this guy. Yo, I will say, though, this fountain is, like, very detailed. And the build all around is pretty good. I will give this a 7.7 7 out of 10. Wait, no. You stole my building. 6.5. I'll give you an 8. Out of 10, bro. Let's go. All right. Thank you, bro. Thank you. Thank you. Thank yep. You, All right. Let's, let's go on to mine, and I'll show you guys what a real civilization looks like. Come on. Oh, my gosh. Yo, we have the sand civilization. So over here, we have- Yo, how come these kind of look like toes? They're actually- Wait, yeah. They look like single boots. You guys are <laughs> actually idiots, bro. Izzy, if I'm a civilian of this civilization, how do I get up to my house? These are the towers to defend. Follow me, and I'll show you the houses. Whoa, wait. No way. What? Down here, hidden from everybody. No freaking way. Oh, fart. Major fart. This is sick. Yo, they're all headed inside for some reason. Oh, this is crazy. They're loaded too. These guys even have two kids. Yo, what's up, little guys? We bounce it on the bed. Bouncing on the bed. Oh, and they have the lower, guys. There's a reason why they hide under the sand. We are cursed to forever stay hidden. Do not go outside. The cacti speak. Yo, what is in the what is in the cactuses? The cactuses outside are previous villagers. Yo, this is actually kind of crazy. I do like these towers, though. These are kind of cool. Come over here. You guys didn't even see, bro. You didn't even see the final thing that they have behind this painting. No. No way. A secret door? The villagers the can't go outside, so they found a way to go into the nether, guys. My mind is, like, actually blown right now. I can't even lie. Izzy, this went from, like, a 2 out of 10 to, like, a 9 out of 10. Dude, a 2 out of 10, bro? I just gave you a 9, all right? I'll take the 9 out of 10. I'm gonna honestly give this a solid 7.5 out of 10. I liked it. It was good. I don't even know. How did we just go into the nether from the over... That was crazy. They're extremely smart. All right, gentlemen, let me show you an even more dangerous civilization. This is modern day. Now, it doesn't look that dangerous, but maybe we should take a closer look. Yo, these buildings kind of look a little familiar. Nah, nah, nah. I don't even want to hear it. Don't even try it, pal. GTA 6. Hey, hey, stop. Stop killing everyone. Hey. Why is it nighttime? Oh. Well, maybe there's going to be a little more killing because I have this needle. Oh, my God. What did he do? You guys better run. What did you just do to that villager? Yo, I'm in survival. Yo, oh, my God. Run. Now that you guys are in survival, try to find the helicopter. I went in the hospital. I went in the hospital. Dude, they're coming up the hospital. Yo, I think this is the right way. There's parkour. How did you guys get up there? Dude, oh my God. My game is lagging like crazy, bro. Let's just go ahead and make a little staircase for the zombies. Yo, what? There we go. I'm going up, bro. I have to leave you, man. I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm in patient zero storm. Wait, what are you talking about? Patient Emergency zero. roof access. I'm going up. I'm going to the roof right now. You found it. You found it. You found it. Oh my gosh. You guys are actually going to make it. Look, the helicopter's here. Jump. Do -do 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 I'm in. I'm in. Oh, wait. Is that the pilot? <laughs> I pushed a villager down. There's only enough space for one person. <laughs> wait, yeah. That's so funny that you just like pushed him. Yeah. Ha, ha. <laughs> I hate you. No, I'm winning. I'm, I'm killing them. I'm killing them. I don't want to live like this. Oh, what? Goodbye. But oh, wait. He survived. Yeah. Yo, you guys have got to admit that was pretty sick, right? What were those zombies, bro? Bro, they literally destroyed like the entire lobby. Listen, it's really good. It's not perfect, but we survived and that makes it even more fun. So I'm going to go ahead and give this a 9.5. Let's go. I'm going to I'm going to rate it an 8.5. Wait, that's actually pretty good. Let's go. And the next build is Carnival baby. See you later losers. <laughs>
<laughs> okay, so we only have one box left, and it is literally the scariest box of them all. The spooky mirror box. So I'm just gonna go ahead and pop open this bad boy. Okay, that's not so scary. It's just like a glass block and wait yeah we just have like a mirror okay actually a mirror could be perfect for a carnival because they have those like fun houses that have like the funny mirrors on them except that i don't know how funny this mirror is gonna be guys i'm gonna poop my pants bro he's gonna make us survive some stupid dumb scary like like thing again yeah, yeah but like clowns and stuff bro no i can't do the clowns i hate clowns i hate clowns no no i mean i'm not scared of him or anything i just you know I dated one before. That, that's pretty scary, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, it was it was depressing. Okay, let me just set them all up like that. And okay, it seems pretty normal. It's not doing anything. Maybe I just need to get a little closer. Yeah, that's literally me right there. Yeah, he's just standing there all menacingly. Wait, if I drop a block. Yeah, you could see the block. Okay, maybe I just need to get a little closer. Oh no, guys, guys, I'm actually scared. Okay, I don't see anything at all. What the? Yo, what is that noise? Yo, he went invisible, bro. Guys, I went spectator mode. He went invisible? Yo, if they want to look into the mirror, they can. Is that, is that me? Wait, there's a mirror. Bro, what? Bro, there's a mirror. Wait. Oh my God. Whoa. Wait, ah! What the? Wait, what did he do? Did he just get like really close to the mirror or something? Wait, what is going on? Oh no, I'm getting off. They're dead. I, I, I killed them both. Well, since there's no one left in the build battle, I, I guess I win. 